In today's video, we're going to take a look at the fixture control or the fixture selection area of the console. We'll take a look at the important buttons we're going to look at are odd even, fan, and highlight. And included in that, we'll, we'll look at also single, all, and next and previous head. So if I pick my group of fixtures I have here, group seven, if I click odd and even once, I get my odd fixtures. I can then record a group out of those. It says here, Maverick spots odd. And then if I click odd even again, I get my even fixtures and you can see I've already recorded and grouped my even fixtures. So this is a quick way that we can make lots of groups and record different groupings and stuff. If I hold down the odd even button, I get other choices here as well. So I can pick every third, every fourth, every fifth, and then ends, anytime you see ends in the software, that's an integer that you can put in. So I can put in something, for example, like six, and then pick ends, and now I have every sixth fixture. So I pick the fix, first fixture, then it skips five, and it picks the sixth. If I click next head, it'll skip over to the second fixture, skip five, and pick the next sixth fixture. I can always pick all my fixtures again by hitting all. I can then go back here and I can pick some other different things like different segments or different groups. So if I go into segments, I can pick segments of again, two, three, four, five, and six, and then end segments. So if I pick segments of four, it'll give me groupings of four fixtures at a time. If I say next head, it'll give me the next four and next head will give me the last four. I can then pick all fixtures again. And the last one we'll look at is groups. I can pick groups of threes. And again, I'll get the first fixture, skip two, and it gets the third, skip two, get the third. And then it will maintain that as I pick next head, next head, next head. It'll give me those, those same groupings. The same concept is also available in the fan option. So if I clicked on fan, I can easily fan any attribute. In this case, I'll fan position. So I'll take fan or pan, and I can fan that out, fan it in. If I straighten it out again, and now I can fan things in different ways. I can fan things symmetrically from the end. I can fan them in different parts. I can also fan in different segments. So for example, I can go into segments of three. And now if I fan them, you'll see I get segments of three. I get a group of three, group of three, group of three, and another group of three. And then lastly, in the fan area, if I pick different groups, so if I pick two different groups, stage left and stage right spots, this is one group here, this is another group here, and then I go into my fan, I can say group parts. And now if I fan my group parts, it'll fan each group separately as its own fan. So now I can fan each one independently as its own group. The last button we'll take a look at is highlight. Highlight works the same as it does on a lot of other lighting boards out there. If I pick my group of fixtures and I highlight them, now if I pick next head, it will highlight one fixture at a time for me. And now as I go through, it'll force one fixture to go to open white. It'll open up, usually it'll open up the zoom. It'll kind of put it into a, um, into a highlight mode that we call it. And this allows you to go ahead and focus on one light at a time where I can dial it in really where I want to get it to. When I take it out of highlight, it maintains the position that I just put in, but it goes back to the original color that I wanted. So I can find its partner. I can also bring that one in, take it out of highlight. And now I can see that I've got my two fixtures here. If I want to pick all my fixtures again, I can just click on all. If I want to go down to a single fixture, I can just pick single again. And we get down to that single fixture and I can then move forward by clicking next head, next head to work on individual fixtures. I can always use shift and single, and that will give me symmetrical pairs. So now if I click next head, I get pairs of fixtures. 
and it allows me to make positions a lot quicker if I want to do symmetrical pairs of things.